What's going on everybody? It's your boy George from JP Custom Inc. And this time I want to show you guys uh, how to press our digital heat transfer vinyl if you do order it from my website. Um, basically this is what it is. If you're too busy, you don't have the equipment, you can actually go on our website, make your order. The minimum is 12. Uh, this is not paper, this is vinyl. Uh, as you can see the price here, three by three is $2, four by four is $3, five by five up to 10 by 10. So once you purchase that on our website, we'll give you a mock-up, show you what your uh, image is gonna look like. And then once you give us a go ahead, we will print it and shit out the, ship it out the next day. Now, what are you getting in the mail? So now, I just want to say disclaimer, this is not for sale. I just took this image off Google just to kind of show you guys. So let's say you get a eight by eight, you get in the mail, this is what it is. You will get your instruction as far as um, the temperature, uh, which is 330, 10 seconds, and hot pail. So all that will come with it. So now let's say this is what you ordered. What you're gonna get is your image and all you have to do is basically peel the backing and then you do, you can throw that away and all you're left with is your image and it's going to have the transfer sheet on it already you don't need that we provide that for you and all you have to do is measure it okay and this is basically um, the transfer paper is actually heat transfer paper so it won't burn so all you have to do is basically make sure you got it lined up like I said 330 10 seconds once that's done I'm gonna do another three second tack um, you should be doing that anyways with regular vinyl so we'll show you how that looks so like I said, if you don't have time, you don't have the equipment, uh, we can do all that for you. Now, if you did this in vinyl and you had to do, let's say 20 of these shirts, you need white vinyl, black and red. You got a weed, you got a cut and all doing all that stuff. So, but we can go and take, take care of that for you. And then just peel hot or warm. And this is what you get. And it's very thin. Like I said, this is not paper. This is actually, it's a, it's a vinyl. So this is, uh, this will work perfect to any kind of job. What I like to do is go ahead and tack it for another two seconds, literally two seconds. And that's about it. And you're ready to go. And it doesn't have to be one, two color. We do full color. It doesn't matter what it is. Um, that's it. Um, the same way we did the HTV. Well, we also do the glitter. And this is uh, one of the glitter. This is two inch. So the same thing we do with the glitter. And I can show you that right now. And by the way, this shirt looks good. Feels good. Um, I'm going to flip this and do the vinyl. The Glitter heat transfer vinyl is the same thing. You basically pale. You have just your image. Same concept, same heat temperature. Um, we do this at 330, 10 seconds. And this one is a heat transfer printable glitter. So you can only imagine if you had like 40, well, let's not, let's not say 40 colors, but Let's say you had six colors. Can you imagine you have to do 10 t-shirts, six color vinyl, how much that would cost you, right? Give that a little rub and it should be able to peel like so. And there's your glitter. Easy as that. So this is printable. Like I said, this, you would have to do this in two different colors. And not only that, you would have to try to match it up so it doesn't look like it's, uh, you know, kind of off. Or you would have to, um, I would say, best way to do it is to basically print it, as you can see.
that's pretty much it. Any questions, just let us know. Uh, it's George from JP Custom Inc. Uh, you can find us at jpcustominc.com. And uh, that's about it. Peace.